I've been at my new place now, tomorrow will be three weeks. And something I've noticed that I'm really glad about is that um, my trichotillomania is almost in remission. I barely been pulling out my hair at all. Um, maybe once or twice a day or nothing um, in that whole time that I've moved here. So I'm so happy about that because I, I don't mind wearing those scarves that I was wearing in past um, vlogs, but sometimes it got really annoying. And then I take off the scarf and I would be really annoyed because I keep pulling and I would actually be pulling out hair. And it's so many different lengths, but it's all like here and I tie it back so you don't even notice that it's kind of in there so it's completely hidden and nobody sees anyway um, but um, I'm still feeling really good I went shopping today I went to the big grocery store and I went to the pet store and I'm really happy my um, roomies relatives are here and I mean they're pretty nice I guess, like, I can notice a little bit of tension between my roomie and her family, but um, basically they're nice people. Um, they're pretty quiet. Um, they're helping Rumi do the rest of her move. And um, another funny thing that happened today was that I thought I lost Speckle, and I was looking all over the house for Speckle. And I'm like, I know she didn't go outside. Um, and then it was funny because... It was like a while had gone by on and off for like, I don't know, half an hour or something. And then I heard her collar. I heard her when she shakes her collar. And she came out of the bathroom. So I forgot that she liked to sleep on the counter of the bathroom. Um, so I'm, I'm not used to that because at my old place, she never slept in my bathroom at all. And Bob is kind of deserted me. He has decided that he likes my roomie's bed better than me. And even though we're having, we have relatives, roomie's relatives, who he doesn't know, and he's usually a very, very shy cat, he doesn't seem shy around them. Um, it's almost like I think, what's wrong with them? Is he okay? He's 20. You never know, right? But I'm glad. He still loves me. I go up and he purrs and he licks me. So maybe, uh, maybe he's, he should be fine. And I'm just glad that I'm feeling okay. And I've been on Twitter more. Sometimes when I feel depressed, I'm never around because I'm too tired to get out of bed. So, yay.